Hi, I'm Arvind, and I'm a product manager on the Microsoft Enter team. In this video, I'll be talking to you about how you can provide just-in-time access to applications like Amazon Web Services. As customers embark on their zero trust journey, minimizing the number of persistent admins becomes a key piece of the strategy. At the same time, employees need to quickly get access to resources to get their jobs done. Let's take a look at how you can use PIM for Groups along with provisioning to provide just-in-time access to permission sets in Amazon Web Services. Now I'm in the Microsoft Enter portal and I've added the AWS application to my tenant. I've set up single sign-on, I've set up provisioning, and now within users and groups, I've assigned the AWS administrator access group to my application. I've gone in to AWS directly and then assigned this group to necessary permission set. Once I've done that, I'll switch over to Privileged Identity Management, where I can decide which users are eligible for this group. I've assigned Nestor as an eligible member of the AWS Administrator Access Group. So now when Nestor needs to get his job done, he can go into PIM, request access to the group, and he'll be provisioned in seconds. Here, I'm signed into the Microsoft Entra portal, and I'd like to get access to the AWS Administrator group. To do this, I'll go into Privileged Identity Management and activate my membership in the AWS group for up to eight hours. Here, the PIM for Group service will go ahead and activate my membership in AWS, and in a few seconds, assign me to the group in Azure AD and trigger the provisioning service to provision my group membership in AWS. Now switching over to the My Apps portal, I can click on the AWS IAM Identity Center application, which will redirect me to sign in to AWS. And because I have single sign-on enabled, I'm automatically signed in. Clicking on the respective account, I can see that I have administrator access and jump into the management console to start doing my job. Well, thanks for watching. To learn more and get started, you can go to aka.ms slash JIT app access.